Art and Health Gaze, um, we have a big collection of artworks that we rent out to healthcare settings, um, albeit care homes, hospices, hospitals, um, dental surgeries, uh, to brighten up the environments. Uh, more recently though we've become involved in thinking about doing more with the artworks um, than just renting them out and hanging them on the walls, but about getting people um, involved in doing art for themselves and really engaging them more in our collection. Um, my name is Emily Learmont and I'm an artist. Um, I'm a painter and an illustrator and I studied at Glasgow School of Art and the Royal Academy in London. And I now do commissions as a painter and an illustrator, um, but I also do a lot of teaching for organisations such as Art and Healthcare. So for the last five weeks I've been coming up to Sunnyside Court with a group of about nine residents. Um, we started off by spending a whole session just looking at five um, paintings from the Art and Healthcare collection and really having quite an in-depth discussion about them. And then the group um, took some of the themes from the paintings and they've been developing them over the last um, five sessions actually and making quite small scale work and developing these into um, a large scale masterpiece um, which is going to be exhibited in the exhibition and the theme of the exhibition is reflections. I've always done art. My father was an artist. There's always been art materials around. And I haven't done an awful lot of artwork and just recently and I thought that would kindle my interest which it has done. I've already got very enthusiastic about doing other things so that's worked for me. I did art at school and was quite successful. Well in fact I won the art prize in the final year but uh, then I just uh, went into business really and it's only now uh, that I'm thinking about maybe taking up painting again, that I'm ret semi-retired anyway. But this session has been the stimulus, uh, otherwise I maybe would never have done anything about my ideas. You're meeting people, you're having a wee chat, and you're friendly, and you're having a cup of tea. So it pushes you up a wee bit, it gets you going. workshop has been a brilliant success in the fact that it's brought lots of residents together and they've all bounced their ideas off one another, given inspiration to one another. Um, the companionship has been brilliant and a couple in particular, the isolation, it really brought them out of themselves and got them to sort of join in and mix with others. Still get to have a laugh. Don't. We use our cup of tea. <laughs> <laughs> 